Oh, no, still on. Ah. Oh, oh, my God. God. I just turned Dude. the camera off. Oh, my God. Oh. <laughs> I think it's a different fish. Hey, this is Luke Simons with Saul Strong. Have some fun fishing footage for you today. It's, it's all big tarpon, and tarpon, are they're just such a thrill to catch. They're just, they're just so strong. They jump. It's just pure chaos when a tarpon is on the end of the line. And then number two is wanted to talk about you know, artificial lures for big tarpon. And so here are three that I was using this day. They all had some action. So I'll show you the footage. And then at the end, we'll, I, I'll be curious to, to hear your thoughts on lures that, uh, that, that you like for big tarpon. And I'll share with you the three that I was using here. So let's dive into the action first. This was actually a tip I got from a community member. Heard that there were some tarpon in this area that was near St. Pete. So I, I got, I had a few hours the, the next morning free. So I went over there, I found a boat ramp that was relatively close. And sure enough, the tarpon were there and it was awesome. Out here with Davis, <laughs> trying to catch ladyfish for, uh, for tarpon bait. He one ups, one ups it. Big old Spanish Mac. All right, we've been out here for what, Matt? Probably five minutes. Yeah, so it's caught a big old Mac and I just lost a tarpon. I didn't even have my GoPro on, unfortunately. Using a uh, DOA bait buster. Uh, tarp had one good jump. It was a nice one. It was uh, probably, I'd say, 100 pound or so. Yeah, it was pushing three. Yep. And uh, yeah, totally ruined the bait buster. So we'll, we'll see what else we have. Birds are starting to get active. Uh, I think we're gonna, I think we're gonna have some some bit rods here. All right, tarpon on. The live target. Still haven't seen him yet. But he's a, he's a good size. Might be more than I can jump finally. Yep, yep, he's getting mad. Whoa, there we are. <laughs> oh, he just got off. So literally my first cast with this live target uh, was it was a good one. Uh, lure slung out, but that was worth it. That was killer. I literally just rolled 20 feet in front of the Oh, oh, just hit it. You've got to be kidding me. Oh, that was a heartbreaker. Ooh, big one just rolled. Pretty close to my uh, my lure. Oh, dude. oh my gosh! I just got bumped. They are all over this bait. Oh, there we are. Oh, oh no, still on. Ah. Oh, oh my God. God. I just turned dude. the camera off. Oh my God. Oh. <laughs> I think it's a different fish, dude. I had to, the other, the other one was definitely a different fish. Uh, that's awesome. wow. <laughs> I got the troll motor going now. Ooh. This one's fighting harder than the other one. Now it's the tug of war time. It's right on the front of his mouth. So I'm gonna try to swing him back. No, he's not quite ready. Yeah. Not quite ready. Oh, so my line is wrapped underneath his body. Let's see if I can twist them over. This is gonna be a tough one here. It's going on the boat. Yeah. Oh, that's not good. Whoa, that was a close call. Yeah. Back here. No, he's, he's up in front now. Oh, dude, what, what'd you do? my reel just broke. Oh, <laughs> that's not good. <laughs> All right, so get those gloves, get those gloves out of there. Where are they? Rubber gloves under your feet. Got to hand line them. Yep. So big problem here, the reel literally just broke on this tarpon. Hand line time. All right, you got the rod? I got the rod. Let's see if we can 
do it the old fashioned way. <laughs> that was not expected. I don't know what else to do other than try this. Oh man. So he's already pretty worn out, so. I'm gonna open the bail on this. No, keep, keep the drag going. Just, okay. It'll just be back up. Oh, there it is. There's nothing we can do with that. Oh well, it's still fun. Unbelievable. Tarpon totally busted. Totally busted up the reel. All right, well, that was the footage. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Yeah, we went out really uh, planning to just catch ladyfish and, and use that, those for, for bait. And then really, you know, they were just hitting lures. So we decided, like, why, why mess with live bait if they're, if they're hitting lures? And so here are the ones that I was using. And so number one was the uh, DOA Bait Buster. And this is the diving version. You know, the, the, they have a shallow run or two where the, the hook eye is on the top. So this is one of my favorite, uh, traditional favorites for, uh, for bigger tarpon when they're out there in the, in the bays and, you know, maybe 10 to, to 15 feet of water uh, or even shallower. This does run shallower. So good, good lure. This was, I uh, had uh, the very first one on this. It jumped and then totally ripped up. You know, the, the plastic was totally ripped off. So I had to switch. And uh, I had just recently bought uh, one of these live target mullets. And so this was literally the first time I've ever used one. And, uh, and it, was, it was good. They were on it. Uh, they, they were hitting this aggressively. Um, this is the one that I, uh, I jumped uh, you know, a couple fish with. And this was the one at the end where, uh, that I had when the, the reel busted. So I lost it. I only had the one. And we had a little bit more time left to fish and I had uh, had one of these on board. This is a spool tech and uh, and we did you know we did jump jump one with this. It it, uh, it slung off. I uh, didn't have the GoPros run at that point unfortunately, but uh, but it worked and it's a it's a nice. It definitely looks good in the water. I've had prior success with it and, and so these are typically the three lures that that I I like to carry on the boat just in case I come across some big tarpon like this. I'm by no means a tarpon expert. I just go after them when the conditions are right. Uh, in this case, I had that, that tip from a community member and, and just made the best of it, and it was an absolute blast. So please do leave a comment down below. I'd love to see you know, and hear about the, the lures that you like for big tarpon so that I can go out and get some and have them ready for, uh, for next season. And if you're not yet a community member, I highly recommend giving it a shot. It's the largest network of anglers who are helping anglers that, that I've ever seen. And, uh, and, and just, you know, we obviously provide, so after this trip, just a few days later, I, I posted this footage and I literally showed on exactly on, on Google Maps where I was so that, you know, members who were in the area could go and, and have fun too, but members who aren't in that, in that specific region can go find similar zones near them that are most likely going to have feeding tarpon as well. This started over in the, in the Tampa region, so there's just a, a ton of, of detailed spot analysis there, obviously, but it's really grown to, to really cover, you know, the, the entire state of Florida and even the southeast. All the way over to Texas, we have a lot of members who are posting really good reports with, with real-time tactics, and up the Atlantic, too, all the way up to New Jersey with some just, again, real-time tips of, of exactly what's happening with, with uh, you know, people who will be, will be happy to help help any answer any questions you might have so again if you're not part of it highly recommend giving it a shot i'll put a link down below for details but otherwise thank you so much for your time and watching this video hope to learn about some cool lures for big tarpon so again if you have any leave a comment down below hoping you get on the water soon and catch some big ones